there he is, just an old man with a vision. I've poured the word of God on my heart. I really have wore out three Bibles. I have the cassette tapes, but three of them I listen. And why do people not freak out when the trees start losing their leaves? You know, oh my God, the trees are all sick, they're dying, they need vaccinated. We need to vaccinate all the trees because, oh, look, the leaves are turning, they're falling off, they look like they're, they're dying. That's the same thing that happens to you when you get the seasonal cold. You're detoxing from all the bull crap you put in your face, your pie hole, throughout the year. And the chemicals we breathe in the air and the, the household cleaners and the, wherever you work. And I mean, like when I finish a hardwood floor, I get flu-like symptoms for two days after that, every time. It, it's not, you don't simply get sick. You don't simply get sick. It's what you take into your body. And that's, I can say this in the spirit. It's not what goes in a fella that corrupts him. It's what comes out of him in the spirit. But in the flesh, definitely what you take in your pie hole corrupts you. See, the flesh and the spirit are completely opposites. It's like, it's like the magnets. You know, you play with magnets when you're little. The spirit and the flesh, that's what we are. We're that magnet. And the spirit and the flesh constantly wrestle. Who is your master? Who are you following? Who are you believing? Well, when I was... I'm going to say three, probably four. I got born again. And I remember walking down that aisle in that old musty country church and the Holy Ghost getting hold of me. And boy, my Bible says he will never, ever leave or forsake you. And he's been, I've left my, I've left my Lord several times, but he has never left me. And every time I say, hey, hey, but Hey, man. Hey, buddy. Hey, God. He's right there. You don't have to seek too far. It's like Peter was walking on the water. He threw that hand up. Jesus is right there. You need. I don't care. See, that's what the church has told you guys. You got to be this and that and the other. You know, you got to have a certain haircut and you got to smell good and you can't smoke cigarettes. Mm -mm. You can't. Uh, I accidentally dropped the F-bomb every now and again. You have to be perfect to serve Jesus. <sighs> Read your Bible. Do you know who Jesus come against? Them dudes that thought they were perfect. No. You have to have a good heart. <clears throat> you have to love people. Love is it. But you need love. And I'm telling you, don't let the church beat y'all up. I'm telling you, the worst among us, everyone, anyone that's hearing my voice right now, you know I love you. And I'm telling you, seek Jesus. Just say, hey, Jesus, do that. I mean, for real, out loud, say, help me, Jesus. No matter where you're at, what's going on, out loud from your lip, help me, Jesus, and see what happens. I absolutely absolutely do want to absolutely do want to if <laughs> you ain't that funny uphold Jesus I have an incredible life I do I, I absolutely it blows my mind to things it's just I have the best wife, I have the best ex-wife, I have the best mother and father, the best children, I have truth friends from all over the world, I mean, I got buddies in Australia, we both see the moon at the same time, how does that work on the globe, it don't, but in real time we both see the moon, whatever, and I, 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 I got this new plate thing I want to show y'all. It's like crazy. I always knew the moon was like a frisbee, 
The moon is a upside down frisbee. And it's going in the firmament. The water's above. And when you dip that plate in there, it's just, oh, everything is, you, you have to study to show yourself approved. If you distrust the TV and the school system and you rely on that for what you are, uh, you're, I don't use this word lightly, you're retarded. Do not trust. Oh boy. Forgive me for a minute. Oh. Oh, I didn't have the safety off. It's Uncle Mike. Oh, you gotta run these varmints off. But if you do not seek and search for Jesus, it says it. It's everywhere. It's, it's, you don't willy-nilly get wisdom. It's like every time I read about wisdom and that, it's like, if you do this, if you do that, if only. It, you, you don't just wake up in the morning and get it. It's if you do this, if you do that. There's a, you have to try my gosh, if you don't try, if you don't seek, you won't get. I love you. Later. And here. I've always said you must be born again, but really you need to talk to Jesus and get a personal relationship. I love you. Later.